Hey, today I'm unboxing an iPhone 13 Pro Max in the silver color. This is a 256 gig model and I recorded this unboxing in an Apple store, which was kind of funny. You can see me with the tripod right there. I had to blur out the people in the background, but yeah, I love the lighting here in the Apple store. So it was kind of fun. The Pro models come in this really lovely black box, which really fits the Pro models. Apple got rid of the plastic wrapping on the boxes, so we just get these pull tabs and the top and bottom to save the planet, of course. Apple also got rid of the charger last year, which means that the box is super slim. This is me opening the box for the first time, and honestly, the lighting in the Apple store is really killing it for this phone. It looks absolutely amazing. I love the steel rails on this silver phone and the reflections that I'm getting here. It looks so amazing. I really enjoyed opening this phone. Honestly, all the colorways look amazing on these Pro models. I just wanted to switch it up a bit. I always had a dark phone, so getting a silver phone was a bit of a change and I'm honestly not regretting it at all. Also, the new blue color is really pretty. Picking up the phone for the first time is honestly an experience. It's so damn heavy. 13 Pro and Pro Max got a lot heavier due to having bigger batteries, which is definitely a good thing, but they get and they feel like kind of fatiguing after a while to hold, especially these Pro Max models, which are absolutely huge. Definitely before you buy one, go see it in a store to see if it's not too big for you. My hands are quite kind of large, so it's fine. And I enjoy having the larger screen and the endless battery life of this one, but it's honestly really heavy and can get fatiguing after a while to handle it around. The unboxing experience is super simple. We just get this Apple sticker, some documentation, the SIM card tool, and an USB-C to a lightning port. Sadly, no USB-C on the iPhone. This is me turning on the phone for the first time. Honestly, this huge screen is amazing. You can really see that on the video, but the screen is so good. Apple did such a good job. One thing that's kind of disappointing is that the notch is still there. And honestly, it doesn't really matter if the notch is smaller or bigger. It's literally the same, same thing. But I kind of got used to it and I don't really mind the notch anyways. But if you do, this smaller one doesn't really change much in my opinion. I took the phone out for a little walk around Tower Bridge to show you how it looks at night or in not as good of a lightning as in the Apple store. I honestly think this is one of the best phones out right now. I absolutely love it. And I don't want to sound like too big of a fanboy, but I honestly think it looks amazing. And I love the design, even though it's a few years old now, like the main aspects of it. I truly think it looks absolutely beautiful. I'm really happy with it. I hope you like this video. If you do, then consider subscribing and thanks for watching.